some fishing bait for tomorrow because of the shadow but got a little crab you know right there there's some crabs got some mussel got some gopher just a few just came to a spot there's not many here but i just got a few 
Just to fish for a little bit. I'm frozen. What's up everyone? Out here in the O side. We go out to the pier this time again. Check it out. It's getting a little bit more active with the croakers. Today's target is croakers or sargos. Maybe even the leopard in between if those aren't biting as much. Up. It's empty out here this morning. It's approximately 4:50 a.m. Right now, I'm gonna rig on some ghost shrimp that was freshly cut yesterday. Using the high low rig. Sí, aquí mero, a ver. A ver si caen. No, o sea, a rato está llega la que no. ¿Cómo? Digo, a rato llega. Ajá. <laughs> a ver, un rato está allá arriba. Alright. Okay, this one was some thread. First cast. Let's see if there's any bites. Yeah, the tide is low today. Alright, so now that I got the first one out. You always want to make sure you prep your net. First one on. That's what we got here. Oh, you elephant? She ain't got it. Actually, it's too small. Oh, I'll deal with it. Look at it. I 
fish on. Nice. Croaker. Oh, Corbina. Look at that. Nice. Yeah. Oop. See that? No Corbina. It's a beautiful fish. Look at that. Still got a bait on there, got throw back. Nice, another croaker. What kind of fish? This is a croaker. A a ye yeah, yellowfin croaker. With a sea croaker? Yeah, croaker. Is it good? Yeah, they're good. It's white meat. Nice. Fish, like, do you get one and then you're done? Or will you stay and get more? Um, I usually stay. I'm. I'm planning on taking off around eight, eight or so. Oh, okay. So yeah, How we'll see. How many do you usually get? It, it varies from day to day. Sometimes. But I mean, your limit, your limit of these species, is ten per day. Yeah. Cool. <laughs> yeah, thank you. Elephant right. croaker, you can hear right there. Can keep this one, it's bigger than that first one.
All right, let's see you throw it back in the water. Come on. Uh, croaker, you una corvina. Ahí en el bote. Spot fin. Y hay apenitas estaban en su lado. Se sangró y Ahí va, ahí va. Va poco a poco. <risa> sí, bien sangrado que estuvo. En la mera la orilla. If you ever decide you want to use fresh bait or even live bait that you can find at your local lagoons or local beaches, please ensure you do your research first. You know, uh, make sure you have your your California fishing license, even if you're just getting bait, you know, because these these um, California rangers, they are sometimes with binoculars, you know, spotting out places, looking for incidents like this where people might be in violation. So please ensure you are, you know, taking your precautions. But yeah, for example, if you ever want to go for ghost shrimp or, you know, mussel, for example, which I'm using in this video, make sure you end up getting your fishing license even if it's just for one day it costs about 16 bucks for the whole year around 60 dollars or so you know it's better paying it's better paying that payment rather than you know like a ticket worth hundreds of dollars you know take your precautions and have fun fishing You guys can see it out there with dolphins just coming up. Yeah. It's just right here, all set here. 